ChatGPT is actually quite good at rewriting code and helping you write code iteratively, but that's the key, right? You, you can write entire applications, but just like if you're writing an application without it, you have to do it in an iterative fashion. So let's say I wanted to add another feature to this React application. I have this today's focus, but uh, it doesn't pre-populate any of the tags. Let's say I wanted to have multiple tabs here that I could create dynamically and have the tags be pre-populated. Well, what I would do is I would come in and I would say, here, this is what I want, but then I also have to give it the context of the application. And I have to give it as much context as possible for it to be successful in giving me as precise of a response that I can just drop in and copy and paste. I have a task service that's responsible for the tasks that talks to the back end. I'm going to put that in. And it will look at the names of the files. So you don't have to say, hey, this is my task service. You can if you want. I'm also going to put in a portion of the dashboard. And we're going to come in here and put in. So I will say, since I don't have the entire file here, portion of the dashboard. I'm also going to give it the tasks filter since that is important. As well as the model, the main model, which is the task. So if I put that in, it will give me a response and it will be a pretty decent response. But if it isn't exactly what you're looking for, or if it's missing, because it will, it will potentially be missing some parts, you can then go and say, hey, well, what about this? Can you add this other, other part? So it's going to write out the code based on the context that I get, gave it, but maybe I didn't give it enough context. And it will get you a really good way to, uh, uh, you know, adding this new functionality but then you will have to have a continued conversation if it is missing some pieces. But that's it, that's all there is to it. It's essentially just add enough context for it, be, for it to be successful to give you a precise response that makes it as close to a copy and paste as possible process. All right, that's it, thank you.